really wanted for Christmas was a local vaccine, but... The University of Queensland vaccine um, will not be able to proceed. 50 million planned doses scrapped after triggering false positive results for HIV. As in science, things don't always go right. It's certainly a tough day for the, for the team. The UQ vaccine applied a molecular clamp closing the coronavirus spikes using an HIV protein which falsely triggered infection markers. Everybody who had the vaccine uh, did show some level of false positive result. One of them, Mel Stott. So I can totally understand where they're coming from, but I still have no concerns about my health or anybody else's health. The vaccine was proving effective in trials and the participants were at no risk, but... The risk to vaccine confidence was the principal issue here. Vaccine expert Professor Nikolai Petrovsky says he raised the alarm early. Our feeling was it, it, it was too experimental a technology to be rolled out. No warnings were ignored at all. Professor Murphy says the risk of false positives was always known but considered small. Unfortunately, it just became a bigger problem than anyone had anticipated.